uh, we're going to switch gears just a little bit because we've got some big news involving one of the most controversial people on earth. His name, everybody knows it, Mahmoud Ahmadinejad. He's the president of Iran. He helped push Iran's nuclear program. He's been accused of being a Holocaust denier. He's even questioned whether 9-11 was an inside job. But this weekend, Iranians overwhelmingly elected a much more moderate successor, Hassan Rouhani. And earlier, I spoke with ABC's John Carl, who's filling in for George Stephanopoulos on this week. John, brass tacks, is this going to make any difference for Americans? Can we worry any less about the possibility of a conflict with Iran now? Well, maybe a little less, Dan. Look, it's clearly good news for the United States to see those long lines, to see people turning out in Iran, voting not just for the moderate candidate, or at least the relatively moderate candidate, but voting for him overwhelmingly, uh, somebody who talked about a more conciliatory approach with the West and more freedom at home. But remember, those clerics control everything in Iran, including the uh, nuclear program. The Ayatollah Khamenei is still the man in charge, and make no mistake, he is avowedly anti-American and pro-nuclear Iran. And this new president-elect is also a pro-nuclear Iran. And John, switching back to domestic news, I know on the show this morning you've got Jeb Bush, the former governor of Florida. You asked him about his mom recently saying that Americans are not ready for another Bush president. Here was his response. What about your dad? Does, does he offer you any advice? Does, does he think you should run? I think we've got a split ballot among, <laughs> amongst uh, the uh, Bush senior family. I'm pretty sure that's the case. So you sat with the man. Do you get a sense that he's going to run in 2016? Well, completely honestly, I, I am not sure about this, Dan, but I have to say, after that interview and after that response, I came away a little more convinced that he is, at the very least, seriously considering a run. It would not surprise me in the least if Jeb Bush runs for president. A potential contender. John Carl, thank you. Thank you. And John will have much more with Florida Governor Jeb Bush and Senator Marco Rubio coming up later this morning on This Week.